94-year-old widow goes homeless after fire burned her home in Imo State, photos? In Imo State on Wednesday, June 14, a 94-year-old woman was reported to have been rendered homeless as fire raised down her mud house. The elderly woman who was identified as Azum Silver Lino Suji was said to have lost her husband about 40 years ago and has been managing life with her son until this tragic incident happened. Part of Osuji's tragedy is that her grandson was partially affected by the fire but was immediately rushed to an undisclosed hospital. Nage.com gathered that the old woman is very poor and only with the help of donations can she smile again. Woman sitting in front of her burned home. This information by made available by Sandra Jur who shared the post of her Facebook profile with the woman's pictures. I'm a first lady can help this old woman. Please keep sharing until help comes her way. Isn't Silver Lino Suji, is a 94-year-old woman from a Mufuku in a Munchai community in the Izilambana local government area of Imo State. Isn't o Suji is homeless as we speak. She has no place to sleep. Homelessness and hopelessness have become the old woman's companion. What is her crime? Her two-bedroom mud house apartment was raised by fire, no thanks to the power surge. She lost everything including her wrappers and cooking utensils. The nonagenarian lost everything in the fire outbreak. Her 11-year-old grandson, the Mosuji, was scalded by the raging inferno and was subsequently rushed to an emergency unit of an undisclosed hospital for treatment. Inside the burnt house. The old woman is poor. I meant, very poor. She told me that her husband died over 40 years ago and she is left with a surviving son, after death had dealt her big blows. Mama said that her only surviving son is still an apprentice and cannot build a new house for her. Let us encourage rich and good Nigerians who have special interest in helping the downtrodden to come to the rescue of this old woman who life has been very hostile to. She is very devastated. Let us help her to live longer before she dies. The wife of the Imo state governor, Neo Mankshi Rakaza Koroka has special interest in this kind of case. She can put smile on the face of this aged mother who despite the hazards of life, God has blessed her with longevity. There are other rich and compassionate people in the society who can come to the rescue of this woman. Two-bedroom apartment won't be too much for this woman. Let us keep sharing until help comes her way. There are good and compassionate Nigerians. I strongly believe that help will come her way if we keep sharing and copying and rebroadcasting this piece.